Hi, this is Andy with Condi Systems, and today I'd like to sh show you how to set up Adobe Illustrator to print to a sublimation printer. Now, this process should work with any die sublimation printer that we sell you at Condi or can have configured from Condi. Um, once you have Illustrator open, you will have to have an image of some sort open to do most of these settings. Here, I just have a blank image open. I'm going to click on Edit and go to Color Settings and I want to make sure we're set to North American General Purpose 2 and we'll hit OK and then I'm going to do File and Print now here we want to come down and select our printer for this purpose I'm going to use the the Rico Efficio SG7100 DN we'll set that as the printer and then we're going to go to Color Management we're going to make sure our color handling is set to let Illustrator determine colors. We're going to pick the printer profile for that printer, which this one will be Rico. Ah. The Rico SG7100 Die Trans Medium SPP. But again, you want to match the ICC profile with the printer that you're printing from. And then rendering intent, you want to set to perceptual. Right, with the Rico printers, the next thing we want to do is go to output and set this to emulsion down. Now the Epson printers, oh, the emulsion down will mirror your image when you print. The Epson printers have this feature in the driver, but the Rico printers do not. Uh, so for Rico printers, you want to make sure you set that. The next thing I'm going to do is come to the general tab. Now here you've got a size, a media size pulled down in the middle. We can actually set this to a particular paper size. Here I'm going to set it to 8.5 by 11 and then I'm going to come up here and I'm going to save this preset. We'll click on the disk and I'm going to call this SG7100 letter. Now I'm selecting the letter because we have letter size paper selected. You'll notice that once this saves you now have this preset. We can actually come over here again and this time I'll select a different paper size. I'm going to save it again SG7100 legal. All right, by doing this, I now have the different paper sizes in Illustrator as a preset. Now where that comes in handy, at this point when you go to print, you do file and print, and you just come up here and you select one of your preset paper sizes. Now I've got the SG7100 letter, letter that I just created. When I select this, once it actually sets everything up on the screen, you're going to notice that we have the right printer selected I've got letter size paper if we go to output our motion is set to down and our color management settings are set so this preset will actually save all of the settings that we did at that point you should be able to hit print assuming your printer has already been configured for sublimation if you have any questions about this or anything else at Condi simply give us a call at 1-800-826-6332 option 2 or send us an email to support at condi.com. Thank you.